Celiac disease is a challenging autoimmune disorder that affects the small intestine. Its pathophysiology, diagnosis, management, and possible therapeutic options have been extensively studied in recent years. The genetic background, HLA, DQ2, DQ8 positivity and non-HLA genes, and environmental factors such as viral infections and dysbiosis of gut microbiota are determinants of the disease. Its prevalence is approximately 1%, with female predominance, and it can occur at any age with a variety of symptoms and manifestations. The diagnosis is typically done through small intestinal biopsy, but highly sensitive and specific serological tests such as tissue transglutaminase, endomysial and deamidated gliadin peptid antibodies are also important in the diagnostic workup. Currently, the only treatment for celiac disease is a lifelong, strict gluten-free diet that improves quality of life, ameliorates symptoms, and prevents refractory celiac disease, ulcerative jejunomalitis, small intestinal adenocarcinoma, and lymphoma. However, challenges remain in understanding phenotypes such as slow responsive, potential, minimal lesions, and seronegative celiac disease, and identifying alternative or complementary treatments to the gluten-free diet. This article was authored by Giacomo Keo, Umberto Volta, Anna Sapuan, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.